you will not believe the high-end designer duds some children are wearing, stuff that would put the old man's clothing to shame. Rob Nelson is on the story for us. They are the queens of the catwalk. Heidi, Tyra, Giselle. But watch out, ladies. The real fashion plates are about to hit the playground. There is a lot of buzz right now about high fashion baby clothes. Some of fashion's biggest names, Armani, Fendi, Versace, are doing something for the smallest consumers. It's very good quality, it's beautiful, and uh, for my granddaughter, I'll buy anything. Several top designers are unveiling their own line of children's clothes for infants to teens, ranging from a few hundred to a few thousand bucks. We can't afford to spend that kind of money on... But they go around on, it so quickly. Yeah. So. Children's lines from Fendi and Gucci have already debuted, and you can expect to see some of Versace's mini-me creations by December. In fact, the company says within the next five years, kitty clothes will make up 10% of its global sales. There's something about being spoiled and wealthy and fabulous that everybody wants a piece of. Some folks say it's just plain crazy. When it comes to shopping for my kids, we do most of our shopping, frankly, at thrift stores, <laughs> hoping to uh, give them an idea of what, what money is really worth and what clothes are really worth. But now, high-end fashion, for those who still have a bedtime, is going mainstream. Fifth grade is about to take over Fifth Avenue. For Good Morning America, Rob Nelson, ABC News, New York. I'm rarely speechless after a piece. <laughs> I'm excited to see the Versace line. That Can you imagine those kids like eating hot dogs or in the playground? Getting, <laughs> oh. Anyway, we want to hear what you think about all of this. Tell us on our shout-out board at abcnews.com slash GMA or Facebook or Twitter.